When it dawned on us that it was 10 o'clock Turn on the tunes to hear the DJs rock The hands got the clapping, the fingers got the snapping Ian, I was cooling with this man who was snapping In and out of fantasies on how large we can get Cooling the rocks and What's up everybody? This is All Things Beer 510 And today we're bringing you a review From Elk Valley Brewing Out of OKC, Oklahoma City This is Rum Barrel Nemesis this is a 9.2% stout, aged in rum barrels with cacao nibs, vanilla, and coconut. Um, big shout out to my guy Travis, who uh, sent me some Oklahoma beers. Uh, he sent me this, American Solara, and some Prairie beers my way. Um, so I'll be reviewing a couple of those real soon. I haven't heard of Elk Valley before he sent me these beers. Um, you know, all I know from Oklahoma is Prairie. Um, and now American Solara, that's all I know. And, you know, Russell Westbrook and, and, and Oklahoma Sooners. So, um, I'm really excited about this just to try something different, something I would never try if I wasn't, you know, doing reviews and, and, and into beer trading as I am. So big shout out to Travis for sending this my way. Um, really excited. Let's see what it smells like, see what it tastes like and, you know, tell you what I think. So. Yeah, Rum Barrel ne Nemesis. Um, I love beers and rum barrels, and this is perfect because this is not a 22 ounce beer. This is a, you know, a 12 ounce can that I can, you know, take to the face after already having a couple earlier tonight. So this is perfect. So let's get a pour of this. Big shout out to all my people in Oklahoma. Um, my, my my pops actually was stationed in Oklahoma, so that's uh, real cool, you know, get to review a beer from here. Um, pitch black in the glass, looking real beautiful. A small, you know, tan head, but for the most part, just pitch black, looking lovely, looking beautiful. Um, let's get a smell. Oh, man. Man, that rum... It smells like um, like black licorice, like it's real strong, a black licorice smell, uh, dark raisins, uh, dark um, toffee notes in this one, a lot of chocolate, um, I, I don't smell the vanilla, um, but I do smell the, the dark roast, and it almost has a coffee presence as well, um, but dark coffee, um, dark roast, some chocolate, raisin, um, you smell the barrel, you smell the barrel, it's evident, 9.2%, it's not playing no games, it's not hiding itself, um, let's get a taste. Oh man, ooh, ooh, that is... You get the coke. <laughs> I didn't smell coconut on this beer. I almost forgot that it was. Um, that this has coconut in it. That is, man. That is good. Um, that is one of the better coconut uh, stouts I have had. Um, this is really good. Um, fresh off the bat, you get the vanilla. It coats your mouth. This is a thick beer, 9.2%. Um, some of the barrel aged beers, you know, hit at the 12, 13% rank. This is 9.2, but it coats the mouth. Um, really fulfilling, really heavy stout, not thin at all. Kind of reminds me of a prairie beer, almost reminds me of Paradise a little bit. Um, the vanilla, the coconut, the chocolate, the cacao nibs, all that in there. You get some dark raisin. Um, you get a little roast. Uh, flavor in that the, the rum barrel is just is is killer it's not too much um but it's letting you know it's there um the rum barrel is giving off that um that just that dark roast flavor um and that fruity dark fruit character as well um everything blends together well with this beer um if you're in the midwest if you're in oklahoma texas wherever they sell this beer elk valley brewing you you know hey um I think they got different versions of Nemesis. There's like a rum barrel, a bourbon barrel, and and different um and different types of Nemesis. This is really good, and I just get like a dark fruit character, um you know with the beer as well. That's probably the rum barrel giving that off. Um, Sierra Nevada. I have a Sierra Nevada Narwhal. That's a rum barrel that I actually have to review real soon. Um, and you know this this coconut is just Monsters Park coconut. 
It was one of my favorite coconut beers. Uh, like I said, this kind of reminds me of Paradise. That's coconut and vanilla. But this coconut and chocolate add in and vanilla adds just it's really good. And that rum barrel is like you know it's perfect. It it it, it tastes like a you know some type of spirit like you know Puerto Rican rum. Like this is really good. Oh yeah, that coconut. If you like coconut stouts. And you're in the Midwest, um, I would say get this beer. Don't sleep. Elk Valley Brewing, really good. Big shout out to my dude Travis for shooting this to me. Um, I would love to try more stuff from them. Um, yeah, um, you know, Prairie, American Solara. And it's good to see, you know, another brewery making a name for itself in uh, Elk Valley. Until next time, you guys take care. Peace.